Hello! Welcome to Stackable, your all-in-one solution to building stunning websites with the WordPress block editor. Did you know that you can use Jet Engine Meta Fields as dynamic sources with the Stackable's dynamic content feature? In this video, we will be discussing our integration with Jet Engine and how you can display your meta fields created with them using our very own Stackable blocks. Setting up your Jet Engine Meta Fields. The first thing you will need to do is to install and activate Jet Engine into your WordPress site. After doing so, you will find the Jet Engine tab in your dashboard. Hover over it and just click on Meta Boxes. This is where you can create a new Meta Field or find your existing ones. Once you click on the Meta Boxes tab, a new page will open. If you don't have any existing meta fields, click on Add New and then fill up the fields accordingly. For this video, you will create a team member field group, so let's add team members as the meta box title. Afterwards, select whether to add this meta box to posts, taxonomies, or users. For now, let's select Post. You can also choose whether to add the Edit Meta Box link to your post so that you can easily edit it at any time with just one click. Jet Engine Meta Boxes also provides you with Visibility Conditions options. You will see here a section where you can select post types where this meta box should be shown. For this, let's select Posts. Afterwards, you can click on the New Condition button. From there, you can choose to include or exclude posts include or exclude posts for certain user roles, and show a meta box only if post has taxonomy terms met. These are just extra options you can use if you want to, but for now, let's leave these as they are since we won't need to use it. Now, you can click on the new meta field button to add the fields. So let's go ahead and fill up the fields by including the team member's name, position, and contact details such as email and contact number. Afterwards, click the Add Meta Box button to save it. Displaying the Jet Engine Meta Fields using Stackable Blocks. Once the Meta Fields are set up, then we can go ahead and display them using Stackable Blocks. First things first, after adding a new post, we will find the Meta Fields at the bottom of the screen. From there, we can populate it with necessary information. Afterwards, let's add a title to the post. So for this, let's make the title Team Member Alex. Once that's finished, let's publish the post. Afterwards, let's navigate to pages in the dashboard and create a new one. We can add any block, but for this video, let's add the Team Member block in order to display the meta fields we just created. Let's first highlight the heading block and then click on the dynamic content icon. Select the dynamic source, which in this case is other posts, and then search for team member dash Alex. Afterwards, select name for the field. We will do the same for the remaining fields. And it's as simple as that. However, you'll notice that the image in this block is still blank. We can also use dynamic content for block image sources. So let's go back to the post and edit the team member meta fields we created. Let's add a field and name it image. Afterwards, let's select media for the field type And let's click 
update MetaBox, and then go back to the post we created earlier. Once we refresh the page, you will then see the media field added. We can either upload an image or select an existing one from our media library. But let's go ahead and choose this image from our media library. Afterwards, publish the post. Now, let's go back to our page which contains the team member block we created earlier. Select the image block and navigate to the image panel under the style tab in the inspector. You will see the dynamic content icon on the upper right side of the image placeholder. Just click on that and follow the same steps in order to fetch the data. And there you have it! Displaying the Jet Engine meta fields using stackable blocks and the query loop block. One good thing about this integration is that we can use Jet Engine custom fields wherever dynamic content is available. For example, if we are using stackable blocks in the native query loop block, then we can also use dynamic content from Jet Engine fields. To do this, Let's add a stackable team member block inside the query loop block. Afterwards, we just populate the fields with the Jet Engine meta boxes like we normally do, and we'll see that the other blocks inside the query loop are automatically being populated as well. Creating meta fields for taxonomies. Another good thing to note is that you can also create Jet Engine meta fields for your taxonomies. To do this, just hover over the Jet Engine tab in your dashboard and then click Taxonomies. A new page will open wherein you will find your existing taxonomies if you have any. If you don't have any existing taxonomies like we see here, click on Add New and then populate it accordingly. For this example, Let's use cars. Afterwards, click on the new meta field button and fill up the fields by including the car model, seating capacity, and speed. Once that's done, click the Add Taxonomy button to save it. You'll find the post taxonomy when you hover over the post tab in the dashboard. Click cars and then fill up the tags accordingly. For this example, let's choose different car brands, models, their seating capacity, and speed. After populating the contents, click Add New Tag. Now let's navigate to a new post. And then first click on the Post tab in the Inspector. Open the Cars panel and type in Toyota Camry in the Tag field. Refresh the page and then let's see if we can fetch the data. Let's add a feature block. And then, when we click on the dynamic content icon, select current post for the dynamic source, and then post taxonomy for the field. For the taxonomy type, you will see what we just created. Select cars, and then for the field, select Honda Civic dash model. Populate the remaining fields, And there you have it. The dynamic content feature in Sackable is a very powerful feature and allows you to do so much more with your content. Pair that with Jet Engine, then it's even better. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. If you need more information regarding Sackable, feel free to join our Facebook community or visit our website. We'll link them down below.